Hello everyone, this is Luxury PL38. Today I would like to do an unboxing of the um, long overdue Alma BB. Um, this is in um, the Cruise Collections in the patent grey that was released um, towards the November December 2019 Cruise Collections. And I realize I haven't actually done the video for this, although I have actually opened the box and um, I purchased this over a month ago, but I haven't used the bag yet. So um, my apology with the um, weird ribbon because it has been unboxed, but because it is new to me, I haven't used the bag. I have to tie the ribbon up myself again and I'm not very good at doing it so apologies for the horrible horrible ribbon um, okay let's get to it and um, this is the Alma BB in grey that was released during the holiday cruise collections I actually requested my SA to order this because I really want the disc versions of Alma BB. It took her nearly a month to get it because it wasn't released in Canada. So um, I eventually got it. I'm not sure whether it was released, but it was sold out or it just wasn't released in Canada. I, I'm not sure, but eventually she was able to get it. And um, this is what it looks like. And let me just throw the boxes away. So, I mean, keep it aside. As you can tell, oh, this is a card, a Christmas card from my SA. As you can tell, this is the holiday packaging. And this is the actual, it comes with the lock and the keys. I put it inside the pouch. And that's the lock because I don't see myself using it on the back itself and um, and this is just the, um, the receive I believe so this is retail for let me just have a look at a receive 2300 Canadian dollars it is substantially more expensive than the Canvas Alma BB monogram. And um, it is probably the same price as the leather, Epi leather Alma BB. Because I do remember that one's um, retailing for 2003 or was it 2002? I'm not too sure. But this is retail for 2300 Canadian. The reasons why I like this is because of the base. And let me just show you. I have an Alma BB too. This is my first Alma BB. So I'm just going to do a comparison. This was actually the first Alma BB that I have in Damia Ladder. And let me just do a direct comparison of this and this one. So if you can look at the patent ladder, um, the grey patent ladder, and if you look at the logos itself, the or the monogram, it is embossed, and um, it's gorgeous. Let me just zoom in, and the base has that monogram all around it and that's the fit with the monogram as well and that's the site and that's the other site and that's the handle the handle has the monogram as well so as you can see the monogram was actually on the handle and on the base and embossed on the grey patent ladder. 
um, I do like Alma BB. I felt that it is more towards my style and it is similar to the standard to Alma BB. It has the hook where you can put the strap. And let me just show you the strap. And the strap is actually comes with epi leather strap. Look at the strap, it's gorgeous. So this Alma BB Cruise Collections in patent leather gray actually has a combination of the monogram and the epi leather. And that's the reasons why I love these versions of it. And let me just show you the inside. It has that, I um, don't know if you can see it. It has, it is, has um, the standard suit on the inside. However, I don't know if you can see, it has a monogram pocket. Okay, that's the logo. And if you can see the inside of it has the monogram pocket. I apologize of the lighting, it is very dark, but um, it does have the monogram on the inside. On the pocket. I will take some pictures and post it on my Instagram account which is the same as my YouTube account Luxury PL38 the inside of the monogram um, and I do apologize because it is very dark and I believe you um, you are not able to look at the inside of it and um, I, I'm not sure if you can actually look. Let me just bring it closer to the light. There you go. Okay, it is a black interior, a suit materials, but it has that monogram pocket. that's the monogram pocket and this is the reasons why I decided to purchase this because I find that it is very unique in terms of the combinations that they use and also because my first Alma BB I bought the Damier because I do understand that the monogram uh, will have a little bit on the facetta will have um, a little bit issues of co uh, colors um, being darker as the time goes by and um, th they do have issues on the base as well that's why I chose the Damier that's the thing about the Alma BB monogram um, the base is actually on a lighter color like that and in time it will grow darker some like it some people actually can appreciate that but um personally i rather not have that issue so i chose the damier but when i saw that um, louis vuitton released this i thought that was a very good alternative to the monogram because the base is actually in this darker monogram instead of the Alma Bibi, the lighter Fashera monogram. So I, I think that with this, um, it is a very good alternative to that Alma Bibi monogram. And the handle itself is darker as well as compared to the monogram versions which has a lighter color and in time um, it might get darker in terms of the coloring and um, the fashada will have um, developed a darker sense of coloring 
So I find that this is a better alternative. And also the leather strap is um is a it just looks better. That's just my honest opinion. So this was actually retail for obviously a more expensive one than the monogram uh, standard BB. It's retail for similar pricing to the ladder, Epi ladder for 2300 Canadian. And um, if you do have any questions, please let me know and comment on the section below. And um, thanks for watching.